Hello, everyone. Today, I'm going to share my daily routine with you. Talking about your routine is a great way to practice English because it includes a lot of useful verbs and vocabulary for everyday life. Let's begin with my morning. I wake up every day at 6 a.m. sharp. My alarm goes off, and sometimes I just want to stay in bed a bit longer. But I remind myself that waking up early is good for me. It gives me time to prepare for the day without feeling rushed. So I take a deep breath, sit up, and get out of bed. First, I make my bed. It only takes a few minutes, but it helps me feel organized. I like starting the day by putting things in order. After that, I head to the bathroom. I wash my face with cold water. It's very refreshing and helps me wake up. Then I brush my teeth carefully. Good dental care is important. Next, I take a quick shower. I use warm water because it relaxes my muscles and helps me feel calm. I use my favorite soap and shampoo and I make sure to rinse well. Once I'm out of the shower, I dry myself with a towel and put on some lotion to keep my skin soft. After I'm clean and refreshed, I go back to my room to get dressed. I pick out my clothes for the day, usually something casual and comfortable. I like to wear a t-shirt and jeans, or sometimes leggings and a sweater if it's cold. Breakfast time. Now it's time for breakfast. Breakfast is my favorite meal of the day because it gives me energy. I go to the kitchen and prepare oatmeal with almond milk. I add fresh fruit like bananas or strawberries and sprinkle some nuts on top. If I'm in the mood for something savory, I might make toast with avocado, some salt, and a little lemon juice. Breakfast is so important because it helps me feel full and focused. While I'm eating, I like to listen to music or sometimes a podcast. It's a peaceful time, just me and my food. After breakfast, I wash the dishes and clean up the kitchen. Keeping my space tidy is important to me. It helps me feel calm and organized. Getting to work. After breakfast, I'm ready to start my work day. I work from home, so I don't need to commute, which means no time spent on traffic. I just go to my desk, turn on my computer, and start checking emails. I respond to messages and make a list of the tasks I need to complete for the day. My work involves a lot of writing, so I need to stay focused. To avoid distractions, I sometimes set a timer and work in 25-minute blocks, taking a short break after each block. This method is called the Pomodoro Technique, and it helps me be more productive. During my breaks, I might stand up, stretch, or take a sip of water. If I have any meetings, I prepare for them in advance. I check my notes and make sure I know what topics we're going to discuss. I enjoy meetings because they give me a chance to interact with my team and share ideas. Lunchtime. Around noon, it's time for lunch. I usually take a break from work and go to the kitchen to prepare something simple. Today, I'm having a salad with mixed greens, cherry tomatoes, cucumber, and a bit of olive oil and vinegar. Sometimes I make pasta with vegetables or a sandwich if I'm in a hurry. After eating, I try to go outside for a little while. A short walk around the block helps me clear my mind and relax. I enjoy looking at the trees, feeling the fresh air, and listening to the sounds around me. When I get back, I feel refreshed and ready to continue my work. Afternoon routine. In the afternoon, I go back to my desk and continue working. 
This part of the day is usually quieter. I try to finish any projects or assignments, and I check my emails again to make sure I haven't missed anything important. By the end of the workday, I like to organize my desk, put away any papers, and make a to-do list for the next day. Around 5 p.m., I finish work. I turn off my computer, stretch a little, and take a few deep breaths to transition out of work mode. Evening exercise. After work, I like to exercise. Exercise is very important to me because it helps me stay healthy and strong. I usually do a workout at home, like yoga or body-weighted exercises, but sometimes I go for a run around my neighborhood. Exercise helps me release stress, and I always feel better afterward. When I'm done exercising, I take a quick shower to wash off any sweat. Then I change into some comfortable clothes for the evening. Dinner and family time. By now, it's dinner time. For dinner, I try to eat something light, like soup or a small salad. Tonight, I'm making vegetable soup with carrots, potatoes, celery, and a bit of seasoning. I like to eat with my family, so we sit together at the table, talk about our day, and enjoy the meal. It's a special time to connect and relax. After dinner, we all help clean up the kitchen. I wash the dishes while someone else dries them and puts them away. We tidy up the table, wipe down the counters, and make sure everything is clean for the next day. Evening, relaxation, and bedtime. In the evening, I like to unwind. I might read a book, watch a movie, or listen to music. Sometimes, I do a little bit of journaling I write about my day, my goals, or things I'm grateful for. This helps me feel calm and prepares me for a good night's sleep. Around 9.30 or 10 p.m., I start getting ready for bed. I go back to the bathroom, wash my face, brush my teeth, and change into my pajamas. I turn off the lights and get into bed. Before I sleep, I like to take a few deep breaths relax my body and think about something positive. And that's my daily routine. I hope this monologue has helped you learn some new words and phrases for talking about your own day in English. Thank you for listening. And remember, practice makes perfect. <laughs>